Hey guys, I have discovered something new today and wanted to share it with you. Working in Premiere Pro, I'm working with two different size videos. This is the first video. This is the size that comes out of my camera, which is 1920 by 1080p. And uh, got some other video that you can see it's a lot smaller here. See, around the bottom, around the sides, that's all blacked out. And I did export this as to be a uh, uh, 1920 by 1080, but when I put it in uh, handbrake to shrink it down to upload it, it changed it. And uh, this is this is what it did. This is the size I needed it to be. This one right here. But this is what handbrake did to it. See how much shorter it is at the top and the bottom and the sides so I, I've got that problem figured out but here's another one another one that I did that had small just just like the other one and uh, it had some uh, small video in it too and it stretched it like this one here so uh, this is what you do when you drag your footage in there, that's what I'm doing. I'm going to a, a, going to the other screen and I'm pulling in a video and I'm going to drop it on here. But do you see right now where it says cropping? It says automatic, custom, and all these zeros and stuff. Well, right now, let me take that back. Pull that file in from the other monitor and drop it in. Do you see it scanning? Okay, as you notice these numbers changed. It's cropped itself. It's going to look like the one I showed you earlier. It's going to do that. If I run it through right now, it's going to do that. It's going to cut all that off. It won't show this to cut that off. But how I got it to do this here is I clicked on custom. And I highlighted these and I hit a, hit the zero on the keyboard to every one of them. That way now it would be that 1920 by 1080p all the way through. And then I hit, uh, of course, you know, uh, Windows 8 phone because then it's a smaller size. And I, so I can upload it. I then click start. Yeah, I got to do the destination thing. You got to give it a name. This is just for demonstration. And then hit start. And it'll start processing, as you can see down here. But that's the biggest thing is about the cropping I wanted to tell you about. And uh, I'm going to stop it. Now. It will turn out like this. So that's what you needed to know. Thanks, guys. Have a good one. And uh, if you like it, like it. And if you uh, subscribe, we'll stay in touch. And if you got any comments about any of these programs or anything I've been offering, leave a comment and we'll go over it next time. Thanks. See you later. Bye. Hey guys, that's it. 
tell them where you've seen it at. And if you like it, like it. And subscribe, we'll stay in touch. If you got any comments, leave them below, and we'll get back to them next time. Bye. See you later.